There is nothing more tarnishing to brand reputation than poor customer service, especially in the era of social media. The uberization of service levels in some fields means consumers expect and demand a level of real-time communication and visibility across the board, with the result that many industries are playing catch-up. We spoke to Paul Whitelam, VP of Product Marketing at Click Software, about how this shift is feeding into the area of field service management. I think customer satisfaction is increasingly important because uh, the bar has been raised by many, many organizations globally. So there's the uberization of customer service. People have an expectation of being able to get service on demand uh, and being able to get insight into the delivery of either be it a taxi or be it the service request that, uh, that is coming to help them out. And so with that comes a rise in expectations. The other angle is that the amplification of any negative experiences through social media is a big problem. And so brands are very, it's very important for them to be able to respond appropriately to service requests. I think technology has impacted workforce management in, in many ways. Obviously mobility itself and putting devices in the hands of the workforce. Um, artificial intelligence in terms of generating an ideal schedule that meets the customer requirements and the business requirements. And then emerging technologies like the Internet of Things, which makes the, the machine the customer uh, rather than the traditional interaction. You can differentiate on a couple of ways. You can differentiate on the cost side of things or you can differentiate in the quality of service. So on the cost side of things, field service enables you to come up with a, an optimised schedule that makes sure that your workforce is in the right place at the right time and your utilisation rates are maximised. On the other side, on the, uh, on the revenue side of things, on the, on the service side of things, you can improve service by delivering high quality, um, high quality service to your customer base and that in turn has a knock-on effect to revenue and service satisfaction. Definitely the advance of machine learning is going to help make uh, schedules ever, ever more precise. And the Internet of Things is also a big game changer as well. So a lot of the uh, information that's coming in to a service centre to request a service, that's going to be generated automatically by a machine. The, the customer is now the machine rather than a customer with a problem. And that's going to lead to much more requirements about processing data very quickly and being able to respond to it in an appropriate way. I think uh, there's a pressure on all organisations, there's a pressure on all organisations' bottom line and you can improve that bottom line in two ways. You can get more revenue and you can cut more costs. And field service management is interesting because it attacks both of those areas. You can use the efficiency that field service management software derives to be able to optimise your, your efficiency, but you can also use it to make much more effective interactions with your customers that reduces churn and has an impact on the top line.